The Indian Army in collaboration with the RDO has embarked on a mission to develop a cutting-edge long-range mobile precision rocket system with an impressive tactical range of 300 km that will have the capability to engage high-value enemy air defense installations, command control communications and intelligence centers, and logistics and infrastructure facilities. It will be a cost-effective system that will make it feasible for mass production and deployment in significant numbers. The Indian Air Force has issued an expression of interest for the indigenous design development and manufacturing of a collaborative long-range target saturation and destruction system that will leverage the potential of autonomous swarm drones to achieve numerical superiority in strike missions in dense electronic warfare environments and undertake missions at long ranges exceeding 1,000 km from the launch base. The system will also demonstrate the capability for long-range regrouping selected targeting and shared intelligence for target selection. A picture of indigenous MS XO2 a midget submarine being built by Mazagin Dock Ship Builders Limited has appeared on social media, and this development comes after the recent successful pressure test of the prototype hull last month. The MS XO2A is designed to be a stealth based platform with minimal acoustic and electromagnetic signatures, and will be capable to transport a pilot co pilot and a combat swimmer team for maritime missions. A joint venture between Hyderabad based Ragu Vamsi Machine Tools and US based Rave Gears have established a high precision gear manufacturing facility in Hyderabad. The facility will manufacture gears and gearboxes for domestic aircraft and helicopters, as well as for the global commercial aviation market. The joint venture has invested 75 crore rupees and plans to invest another 150 crore rupees over the next two years. The United States is in active talks with the Indian government to start production of military systems in areas related to intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance and ground-based conventional warfare. A senior Pentagon official has said that efforts are underway to establish a reciprocal defense procurement agreement with India, which would allow and create the conditions for US and Indian defense industries to increase and streamline market access. The 12th meeting of Malaysia India Defence Cooperation Committee was held in New Delhi, during which both sides have agreed to establish a strategic affairs working group that will handle all aspects of defence cooperation between the two countries. India has offered its shipbuilding capabilities to the Malaysian Armed Forces, and the Malaysian side discussed possibilities for co design, co production, and co development in the field of defence industry. Oh, Mark, drop it.